Hello, my name is Tyler Mannering, and today we're going to be looking at Boxing Day by Blink-182. This was requested by Christian Campbell, and it's a great song for beginners because it's all G. It is basically the G chord. But we're going to be looking at the more complex part, which is the intro, which is finger picking. But you only need two fingers. You know, which fingers you choose to pick, it doesn't matter to me, whatever you find easy. But we're going to pick the third fret of the E string and then the third fret of the B string. You know, get familiar with that. And then you're going to pluck the open string of G. So then after you pluck the open uh, string of G, you're going to go back to the third fret of E, and then go back up to the third fret of B. So then you're going to go down to one on the B string, and then zero on the A string, and pluck those two together. And you're doing a similar motion but you're going to pull off the one. And then uh, pluck the A after you pull off the one, or the G, sorry. I'm going to have a tab right here. This will make it easier so I don't keep fumbling my words. But our verse is going to start off with G. And for those that don't know what the G chord is, it is going to be 3rd fret, E string, 2nd fret, A string, 3rd fret, B string, and then 3rd fret, high E. And it's going to be all variations of this chord. So I'll just walk you through it real quick. Um, we're going to go G. The 2nd chord is going to be 2nd fret, E. And these are going to stay the same during all of this. The third chord is going to be A, which is going to be second fret on the D string and then second fret on the G string. The fourth chord is going to be E which is basically bringing those fingers up, so it's gonna be second fret on the A string and second fret on the D string. So here comes the more complex part of the verse, which is gonna be, it's gonna be harmonics, which is gonna be second fret of the A string and then fourth fret of the D string. And what we're gonna do is gonna play that slide it up to 3rd fret A string and then 3rd fret D or G string and you know you're going to make this faster eventually those are the chords for you and it should when you get done sound like this slower so you guys can follow along. I also want to add that after he plays an open. And I actually had a book talking about how Tom Long plays, and this is what he recommended for beginners, is that he will randomly add openness just to switch to different chords. But basically, he has an openness to the end of the beat. Um, fairly simple. Now we're going to move on to the, the pre-chorus, which again, we're going to be at a G chord. So it'll be G. Second fret, go up to the E. This is going to be the new chord, which is basically C, which is going to be third fret A, then second fret D, and then you have these two notes again, which is third fret 
a B and third fret high E. So it'll be like. Pretty simple stuff. So the chorus is right back to G. Then we're going to come up to the C chord. We're going to go to the E chord. And then we're going to go to the C chord again. So it'll be like, You left me on the day after Christmas. stuff again. So believe it or not, everybody that's watching this, that is the whole song. I'm going to leave plugins down below and I'll even name each part and then put brackets like for breakdown or whatever because the breakdown is the same as a verse. Um, and I hope this helps everybody out. It's a great song for beginners. Thank you, Christian Campbell, for recommending this. I have a couple more that are being recommended that I have to work on. I just have to find a time because I found a new job. And it is uh, second shift, so I'm never home. And it's far away, so I have a long drive in between there. So basically, I don't get too much time to myself. Um, but I'm trying. And I apologize for the wait for anybody that's going to be waiting Next week, we're going to have Good Kid. I'm not going to reveal which song. But, uh, you know, we'll, I'll see you when we get there. See you next week.